Hello, my name is Mohamed Abdo. I am the Acting Director for Culture and the Arts at the Ministry of Culture and Sports. Um, I'm also involved in uh, music production, composition and songwriting, um, especially for national events. Um, COVID-19 came to Brunei in um, March 2020. Um, and when the pandemic started in Brunei, um, we are in the midst of celebrating, uh, welcoming, we are in the midst of welcoming the holy month of Ramadan uh, and then the celebration of Shawwal, of Eid, or we call it Hari Raya in Brunei. Um, so when it came, when the pandemic struck Brunei, uh, basically everything came to a halt and we have to uh, um, adhere to the rules and regulations uh, which has been imposed by our government especially through Minister of Health. Um, this pandemic uh, impacted us culturally and socially, economically uh, as, a, uh, as a result of, of uh, um, cancellations, bans of, of, of um, public coming together, closure of shops, um, social distancing measures, um, new normal such as working from home, uh, which has struck uh, the country with different uh, impacts on, on the different industries, especially in the culture and the arts industry. If I were to zoom in, uh, that we are also impacted heavily due to cancellations and bans on, on, on public performances. So, uh, our, uh, some of our industries, they rely on, on events such as uh, wedding ceremonies, such as uh, um, social events. So, these this businesses uh, were impacted a lot. Um, and, uh, the, the other thing is um, such cancellations and such uh, uh, banning of, of events um, has impacted uh, the emerging or the subsequent business that came with it. For example, um, wedding planners, for example, florists, for example, uh, or musicians and, and artists. So it has impacted uh, in one way or the other, um, uh, but then with every uh, impact, with every uh, uh, deterrent that came, uh, with every problems that came with the pandemic itself, it gave rise to a new normal, a new normal in the sense that we uh, leveraging on the use of uh, technology uh, and also in using uh, new means of achieving or uh, uh, coming to see or new audiences through through online platform the the important part that when the pandemic started um, artists came together and forgot about or, or leave the issues of, of, of the when the pandemic started, um, artists came together and they started discussing on how to motivate the society, how to motivate the frontliners, how to come together and actually in giving support uh, through their art um, to these frontliners and also to the society. So we saw the emergence of, of, of artists, uh, musicians, uh, singers coming together in co-production and it, it was good to see that our our people our, our artists um, produce a few numbers a uh, few productions online to be shared just to motivate um, just to motivate the, the the society now we are 200 over days of uh, no local transmission uh, alhamdulillah uh, but yet we still have to be very careful we are still under the the 
uh, rules and regulation um, we are not at tier 4 of, of our uh, of our de-escalation plan which involves um, which allows for a, a, a group of people not more than 350 coming together which also give rise to the, the importance of of the arts and culture coming together in in supporting such movement. We see uh, such movement uh, coming together, especially our artists, in organizing smaller events, smaller um, uh, smaller exhibitions, smaller performances, uh, which also utilizes online platforms uh, for them to gather together and to express and to also try and, and, and reap the benefits of, of uh, the arts sector through um, the leveraging of technology. Um, we see the rise also in content creators. Uh, content creators, they, they use social media platforms to, to develop uh, uh, content which is relevant to the art, but also which is also relevant to to um, promoting um, the, the issues that is being highlighted by government such as social distancing, such as keeping um, um, good of each other's health and also the importance of, of coming together as a society, as a nation in combating the pandemic. Um, the new normal has actually uh, bring the artists together. Uh, we see collaborations from the national um, at, at national we see collaboration at national level and also we see collaboration at regional and international level um, this this uh, pandemic obviously with all its negative issues but also gave rise to uh, future areas of future give rise to future collaboration within us uh, so I think uh, the importance of us coming together and around 2020 was a very good example. It was a very good concert. Uh, we, do it, we did it with our uh, own capabilities, uh, our own studios. I mean, we are, we are thankful to, to, to KBS and the Korean government uh, in, in bringing us together uh, in, 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 in producing such a very good uh, festival. Uh, and at the same time, we adhere to the protocols being highlighted with our by our uh, uh, our government, especially in, in, in combating uh, the spread of the virus. I would also like to highlight the importance of of, of policies uh, in in helping artists, uh, in helping uh, musicians uh, together. Um, we in Brunei Darussalam we help artists through leveraging. Uh, to, in Brunei Darussalam we help in 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 ensuring uh, artists uh, survive through giving them platforms, online platforms. Uh, the other thing that I would like to highlight is uh, since we are uh, uh, under the de-escalation uh, plan, um, we are concentrating now on capacity building. Capacity building by which we are increasing a number of uh, programs, especially for our youth in, in, in training them to become musicians, to become singers. Uh, we have programs uh, starting last September in helping our young, uh, uh, our young people from, from vulnerable groups who has interest in music, uh, so we open classes every Sundays for them, uh, just to give them uh, an insight into what music education is and how to become uh, uh, the basic of, of, of music for them. We also have programs with with uh, our local TV station, and the next one is we are. Um, also training young uh, composers on the art of comp composition. Uh, I think it's very important for us now since we cannot do, uh, since, since we cannot uh, uh, have public performances, I think it's, it's, it's time for us to develop uh, our, the talents of our young. And this is also important for them who is heavily uh, uh, impacted by the, by the pandemic for them to undergo uh, reskilling and upskilling of, of, of their, their, their talents to give them education on, on becoming uh, musicians, on becoming songwriters, on becoming artists and whatsoever. Uh, we thank the, the government of Brunei Darussalam to uh, the act uh, 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 
the government of Nusra Salam reacted uh, efficiently in combating the pandemic, and we hope that uh, uh, the pandemic will be over so that we can join together hand in hand and, and uh, perform together in other music festival. Uh, with that, I thank you very much. Kamsahamnida. While there were no performances, there were no public appearances by the artists, uh, the music schools were also closed. I think it was closed for more than two or three months that uh, music tuition was not done. But uh, in some schools, they have uh, to, you know, when schools are closed, uh, there are no, no, no learning. But then we still leverage on technology having online classes. Uh, some music schools do, do have online classes where, where students perform and, and have their learning and teaching through, through, through online. Uh, when music schools are closed, we also limit, the, the policy also limit on, on the number of classes available per week. I and mean, when there's de-escalation from level 1 to level 4 now, uh, the, the type of um, learning also change. So for our music education, for our music uh, classes, I mean, they, they were also impacted by, by the pandemic, by which uh, how the lessons were taught also differs. I think it is important uh, that, that the new normal itself uh, emphasize on the importance of, of uh, uh, taking care of one's health uh, in combating uh, the pandemic. But at the same time also, we, we, uh, we have to, to ensure that business still goes on. Um, that the, the, the business of, of, of entertainment, the business of um, education, of, of the arts, will have to go on. Um, the government uh, and, and the, the, the public, the private and the non-government organizations, the agencies, uh, came together in, in in providing uh, good platforms, uh, edu educate platforms for our artists to come together. Uh, this platform uh, uh, is being done either through, through the local community, uh, to district level, uh, also at national level, also at regional level. Um, we come together and, and ensure that uh, cultural activities uh, uh, for example, cultural, we ensure cult at, at that level we ensure the cultural activities and also uh, cultural expression such as traditional music, such as uh, uh, indigenous music, still being practiced and still being being uh, 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 being still being practiced and still being. We ensure that the, the traditional practices such as music or indigenous music or traditional music is still being practiced. We are happy that we are also part of, of uh, uh, a wider uh, um, program that we, we, we join some programs in uh, cultural expression, especially in music and singing uh, with various activities. And, and around 2020 uh, is, is, is uh, another good platform that we managed to bring our artists together uh, despite the pandemic, uh, and for them to, to, to showcase the arts and, 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 and their music to others. Uh, I think uh, we thank Korea, uh, we thank Republic of Korea for, for their uh, endless support in, in, in ensuring uh, that round 2020 uh, was, was successfully done through ONTEC, the online contact. The pandemic also uh, gave rise to the importance of uh, of our content creator. We see a number of we, we see the rise in numbers of our YouTube content creators, uh, not only uh, for those uh, in, in music, but also for those who are in Brunei. Uh, number of <coughs> number of. Um, 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 the number of foreign workers, expected workers who are in Brunei, they are not highlighting Brunei through the social media content. I think it's, it's nice to see uh, that 
the technology plays a very important part and also the 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 situation where where uh, the government and the the government and the uh, the the government and the the con the government and the infrastructure uh, uh, telecommunication companies uh, came together. The government and the technology, the government and the tech, the government and the technology provider came together in in uh, ensuring policy of of uh, uh, giving people a connectivity, uh, connectivity uh, ensure that all sorts of communication uh, are being done without fail. Uh, with a, a good standard, so that's why we managed to, to bring artists together uh, in performing online performances.